So you were running almost at the same pace as Alex and Hayden. How do the legs feel? Felt really good today. Um, not sure what the swim was like. It was quite choppy and struggled a little bit. And then uh, I thought I was going to make the front pack and then I just missed uh, Blumenfeld's wheel and then ended up in the second pack. And then it was a really, really tough ride and it started raining really heavily. And so I was just trying to stay up on the bike and be uh, towards the front. And then um, I felt incredible on the run. Um, I almost felt like I could have gone a bit faster, but I just got a bit of stitch on the third lap. Um, and then, yeah, I was just by myself for most of it. So um, I just had to pace myself and uh, yeah, I felt like I had a bit more left. So yeah, maybe in the next race. I mean, it's only your second WTCS race. Uh, how do you see yourself compared with just one year ago and how much you have evolved in those 12 months? Well, yeah, not even a year ago, two weeks ago in Yokohama, I've learned a lot more and uh, I've just put a few things on the bike to to make sure that I position myself well and work on the skills that I need and so I think it's only a matter of time now that I'll make front pack and stay there and then hopefully it'll be a run race so uh, and the race for the British team to go to the Olympics is still open it's going to be discretionary how do you feel about it what are the what is next for you yeah I mean I'm not sure um, we'll, we'll see in the next few weeks but Hopefully I've shown that I can run really well, even on tired legs. And, uh, you know, if it comes together, then I'm certainly, uh, yeah, one to watch. Congratulations, well done. Thank you.